again, I'm Morgan Weir, Somnambulant Gamer, here today to play our uh, magnificent game Kickshot, our Wesley Hammond, also of Somnambulant Gamer, Sarah Netzel across from me, and Violet Ramos. We just kidnapped her. Yeah. It's okay, we'll return her. We'll return her <laughs> when we're done. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, um, this game, again, is uh, meant to educate people on the basic rules of soccer. Uh, it should be a pretty quick playthrough. Um, Ordinarily, what the goal is, there are two halves to the game, and looking at these chips here, uh, the goal per half is to gain five chips. The first team to ten chips by the end of two halves wins the game. However, in our case, we are going to do a very quick playthrough, so we're going to be playing to six. You stay out of that cat. There's a little kitten monster trying to eat my food. Um, so, how we begin is each team selects a captain. In this case, I will be captain of my team, who I am sitting across from my teammate, Sarah. And Wesley will be captain of her team, who is sitting across from Violet. Um, so, we begin the game by having a roll-off. So, Wesley, um, and you, will you roll off with me? Sure. I got a one. She yes. got a four. So, since Wesley has gotten the highest score there. They will be on the home team and Sarah and I will be on the away team. So first, as you can see, we have our uh, home deck and away deck uh, put into two different decks. This, The bigger deck in our case is the offense cards for when we are in possession of the ball and the smaller decks are for the defense. In the beginning of the game, we start by dealing four of each offense cards to a hand, two, three, four, to each teammate, two, three, four, and two defense. So here we go with this one. Okay, we got that, two here. And then of course, the classic shuffled everything together. And two, Shut. one. Yes, please. And if you would be so kind, Sarah, to take care of that. Um, in the time, of course, we're going to view hands. And we, of course, uh, I failed to mention, uh, apart from the creator, Aziz Makani, um, we also have Noah Croes, who is a fine arts student at the University of Idaho, who actually will be, is responsible for all of the great art, artwork and characters that you'll see here. So both in the creation were very essential. Okay, we get to go on that one. Okay. So, beginning with you, we're going to start the ball from the center mark. As you can see, the home team will begin in possession. Um, in order to advance the ball, I believe that the uh, chart is over here. We need to have the home team captain start. So we need to roll, have Wesley here roll both dice. The higher of the two die is what we will use to advance the ball. However, if the dice roll the same, you know, say snake eyes, then defense will take possession. Okay. Wait all my cards out so okay. you can instruct That's me. That's fine. <laughs> in, in this case, ordinarily, we will not be displaying our cards. But in order to better understand the game and what the cards do, I feel that we should probably display them. Show you have. If you want. Okay. Okay, so you will move this, the ball, six spaces. In this case, the away team side is mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. Our home team is here. So if you would kindly move that six stripes. Or do you want me to? Yeah. Yes, please. One, two, three four, five, six. So she's pretty close to making a goal. If on the next round, the offense hits, um, say one, two, three, four, five, six, if they hit six, or, well, in this case, you cannot get higher, but if they do hit six, then they will be able to take a shot on our goal. So we move to Sarah, since we play in clockwise. Um, if you can intercept or take the ball, then that is what you do. Otherwise, you will be skipped, since we are on defense. Okay. 
You've got so this. So use, put one of the card, use one of the cards? Yes. And then roll the dice. Yes, whatever it says okay. on the card. Okay. So it says, slide tackle, roll dice to perform successful intercept. Advance the ball up to four zones. Beautiful. So there's that. Okay, roll so the dice. roll dice, yes. Both. It's So the die is successfully intercepted, and since it can only move up to four zones, in this case, her largest uh, die is three, so we're going to move that back. One, two, three. Okay, so it is your turn, Violet. And unfortunately, you do not have any cards to take back at this point, so we're going to have to switch to me. I'm sorry. Um, Actually, I think I'm reading that wrong about. You actually add together four. The first one is where you use the minimum. I'm sorry, we're still learning. <laughs> so, we'll do that. Let's see, what do I have? I think what I will use will be a dribble card, which will let me move one zone forward. And that brings it back to you, Wesley. Can you intercept? Okay. Um, unfortunately, I don't no, um, I cannot. Oh, and you need to draw a card, I'm sorry. Oh, draw a card when you play one? Yeah, I'm trying okay. to figure out where the referee cards are drawn at this point. Do, do I do okay. I have to hit somebody or, or some kind of foul play to, to get a referee card? So, um, okay. <laughs> I think that everyone gets one at a time. Um, at this point, I'm unsure, but... For the sake of continuity, um, it's it's not fantastically easy to find at the moment. As said, this is a first iteration of the game. Um, we'll figure this out. But in the meantime, let's all draw a referee card. Face and down or face up? Face up. You, you can draw if you'd like. Um, if a person plays it, in this case we're going to house rule it. If a person plays the referee card, then they will draw one more. So you will always have something in your hand, and you will always have six cards from your team in your hand. Okay. Well, in that case, are we still in my turn? You're still in your turn. Okay. Then I would like to use my referee card okay. to take possession. So since Wesley's team has taken possession, we're going to turn the ball over to home. Okay. Then we'll put that in the discard. Alrighty. Now we're moving. And shall I take another referee card? Yes. Awesome. And Sarah, here we go. Um, okay, so let's use an intercept. Maybe and take it back. Yes. Okay. With the header card. Okay. Roll and dice to advance the ball up to eight zones. Okay. So roll the dice. I'm not sure if that changes possession or not. What did you roll? You rolled snake or not snake eyes, but two. Mm -hmm. What the rule says here on play header, roll two dice on intercepting the ball. The number of the zones to advance is the number of the higher die plus one. However, the ball turns over with this roll. Ball turns over to the new offense with three, four, five, or six on both dice. Offense retains possession with either one or two on either die. So, the ball will stay in home team possession. And I don't believe that we are moving this over. Okay. So, Violet, it is your turn. You actually have a lot of options at this point. Um, you can use any of your cards. What the O means is what your your team is currently in possession, so you can use that. However, it, when you're not in possession, you can use the ones with D as well. So. Okay, so I use either of these two or these two? You can use any of the cards currently. Okay. Okay, you want to use the bicycle kick? 
Okay, let's see, what does this one? Bicycle kick allows you to roll the dice to advance the ball up to nine zones. So that's that's pretty I nifty, roll actually. Roll, yeah, roll the dice. So you can roll them both. Mm. Best roll out of the night. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's pretty good. So, so, so high is plus one? Yes, so it's high, do high, yeah, high die roll plus two. So your high die roll is five. So you add two to that and you get... So I get two cards? Well, we're going to move this up a couple zones. So we're going to move the seven zones. Okay. So we're going back towards ours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you get to draw a card since you used one. Um, so you guys are very close to making a goal on <laughs> this. Yay! <laughs> Woohoo! Gotcha there! Teamwork! Alright. So, in my case, I am going to run the intercept. 